Alright, uh, today just play. Simple play. No explanation to what the character is. This is part 2. You're supposed to learn everything about the character in part 1. Part 2 is designed for me to have some additional fun. And originally this was supposed to be Bakugo's turn. But I just can't get myself to be very angry. At this period of my life. I can be very dark and edgy though. Regardless, it's a lot more fun playing with Ida, simply because he's a speedy boy, and speed is uh, the type of ability that I want the most. I always have problems with being way too slow in everything. As you can notice by my upload speed, but <laughs> don't get me too depressed here. Oh, double... Oh, wow, oh, I broke that? Usually the way this game works is that you can't break armor, with uh, regular punches and kicks, but somehow, uh, just like somehow I converted out of whiff punish right there, I did it. I noticed that there are a lot of things that shouldn't happen in this game that happen. Like, uh, the game gives you some certain laws, and then in other situations it breaks those laws. That's why it's very hard to understand what's safe and what is not in this game. Damn it! my kick was not fast enough, and it was also in range. Not that I was out of range, I was just on the edge of it. Very unfortunate. I believe I'm dead? No, not yet. Miss input level 1. Speaking of level 1s, I didn't use mine. Ooh. You guys... Don't blink. Fun to play. It's because of this reason, it's because you have to deal with people that shoot projectiles a lot and your character is designed to have this one single advantage and that is mobility. He's not really the fastest character when it comes to attacking, neither does he has any crazy mix-ups. His pressure game relies on uh, confirms a lot and confirming is bad with me because I have very shitty reactions. I usually just predict, I didn't react at all. Not the point though. My point was that uh, he has no advantage up close or on range. His specialty is that he is able to go either up close or on range really fast, faster than any other character. And this is the only thing that makes him special. Oh wait, I lie. And because of the way some of his uh, kicks are curved or cancelled, you can do some really sick dodges. I can't believe this is not convertible into full combo. The problem with all for one is that you can never tell when he's in the air if he's gonna go through with the armored move or not. Apparently he can cancel it. Wow, I dodged this undodgeable shit! I'm gonna dodge this as well. Speedy, speedy boy. Probably... I'm not sure if he's gonna hit the wall, then he's dead. God! Okay. Slightly unfortunate. All for one himself. This white boy is not really that dangerous. It's his support. I almost freaking dodged it. Almost dodged it. Damn it. Still pretty bad with his pressure. Again, because of the confirm sense that I didn't have, confirm reactions that I didn't have. I also have to keep in mind that nobody really produces any tech videos on this game with Ida or showcases, oh look, this is some stylish shit that you can do. I have to kind of just find people online that are better than me, then look at what they're doing try to mold it into something mine and uh, invent things, basically. And it's very frustrating when you can't come up with any new stuff. So fortunate. Hope this will hit before Dabi. Level 2. Has this unique stance in the end of it. Reminds me of Dark Souls.
Okay, this guy still has level 2 and muscular support. I will bait out muscular support first with uh, the pressure cancel. Is it the dodge? Six stunt. That's what I call it. Okay. Just, oh my. I'm so glad he didn't go for level 2 straight away. That could have been dangerous. But I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for either two random level 1s or level 2. I can try something though. I can try and do, uh, you know, the race car stuff. <gasps> Absolutely must not get hit by that. Just need a moment. Okay, give me a sec. Give me a sec. I'm doing it. Give me a sec. After the muscular. In the Dorifto? <laughs> this character is cool. I haven't tried Gran Torino yet, but I am somewhere around 90% sure that because he does not have the run and the curves on his moves, there is no way that I would like him more than Ida. <sighs> Deku, that's a normal Deku. Nobody prefers the normal Deku anymore. Aaron goes for shoot style. I'm gonna start with a kick and cancel it into the pressure if he blocks it. If he doesn't block it, then I'll do some random bullshit. I like how he went for the block, but then relisted a second before I yeah, I did it. Oh god. Again! Getting unlucky, bro. The dodge! Oh, got the stun! Oh, wow! I got crazy unlucky. Two times he tried to block and it didn't. Lenny, Ida, come on, dude! This swift punish though. Oh wow! I whiffed it and because I I felt the combo. And now I can't see the Doroki! I don't feel like perfect. I mean, it was perfect, but I failed most of the stuff that I tried to do. I did horrible drops. My character did not land the super. Oh, well, he's trying to do something. I got his support somehow! Again! I just feel as if uh, this person is extremely unlucky. So that I have skills is that he's very unlucky. He's not spamming the bullshit at me. Maybe it's his little brother playing. <laughs> it's not really him. I don't know. He has a significant amount of points, but doesn't feel as if he's really fighting, you know? Doesn't feel like a double P. He's not shooting! What is the bullshit? What is the spam? No satisfaction. So sad, so bad. I really don't like Ida's quirk. Ida's uh, version of a speed quirk. Because it seems very limited. He's not fast with his arms, he's not fast with his body, he's just fast with his legs. And even then, he's just engine fast. How fast can the engine go? Let's say he gets faster than the speed of sound, but I think this is the ceiling. He will never be as fast as Midoriya, which is very sad. I don't think that he will ever go light speed. Simply because the word engine does not scream light speed for me. That's just my feeling about it. He's playing a Stalga. He has a lot of points. I expect a lot of annoying uh, projectiles. Probably will start with one. Nope, armor. Weird. Okay, the problem here is that his quirk projectile tracks insanely. 
so you have to waste plus ultra effort. And this is not something I can do a lot and consistently. Damn it! I went for the pressure strain because I expect him to block again. Okay, this guy does not block. He blocked! Fuck! The problem here is that if I commit to pressure, I fail the full combo. If I uh, go into full combo, I fail the pressure. I have to know, or I have to confirm out of it, and I just <laughs> the, the earphone jack dodge. I just failed to do that because of my uh, super actions. The last kick should have hit. No respect. He's running away to shoot. So hard to dodge this. Okay, keep calm. I have to waste his supports first, this is the problem. But his supports recover, I waste one, the other recovers. How do I... Uh, if I just force it and go in, I will get hit. I feel as if I have to relentlessly tank them, because you can't die from supports. This is not going to kill him. He still has one bar of meter. Have to be very patient here. Careful! Waiting for action. Like this, yeah. Hold on. Okay. Now I'm waiting for our. Uh, not dead yet. Armor. Can't die from sports, it's okay. He's panicking. 10 seconds. I can pressure in. No wall splat! I'm gonna go for the pressure on block. He didn't block! This is as clutch as it gets. <laughs> Won the race against time. I'm gonna take it easy on this round. Distract myself. Get those nerves back on. So here's the point. I. The gravity! The fuck? Do your job! That fall. What was that about? Oh, okay. Mm. A lot of people ask me about uh, characters. Uh, where is All Might? Uh, what is All for One? Where is Mineta? And the point is, I'm saving my favorites for last. So, All for One and All Might, especially All Might, are coming last. Completely last. Super last. The rest uh, depends on a lot of other factors. My mood. Knowledge about the character, how much I like the character, blah blah blah, yara yara. There are some characters that I don't really want to do, like Toga or uh, Earphone Jack. I just don't want to do them. I don't like those characters, I don't like their playstyles at all. There are still characters that I'm saving, like Midoriya. I probably should waste one Midoriya, just for the epicness. I'm getting pretty clutch, give me a sec. God damn it! I just fucking dodged that. Chill. I've collected enough chill energy. <laughs> I, I'm just waiting for the supports. That's why I'm dodging a little bit. Could have been punished, but yeah, didn't really matter. He's way too in it. Well, he's into spamming projectiles, I'm in it to win it. With style, if possible. Or with, uh... Kansai Derifto!